Hello guys and ladies, this is Primo Milk. Here is a tutorial for the Kinetic Tipo Pack for Premiere Pro. First of all, you, we will see how we will install all the Mogrid files. Here in documentation is the CC Graphic installation path for Windows and Mac. You copy all this folder, Kinetic Tipo Pack Mogrid, and after you copy this to your motion graphic templates folder, you will find them all, the mobile files here, and you can import it very easy. Just drag and drop your mobile file here, and you can scale it down if you want a bit, like this. Also, you are able to change the text here. This is the way. If the text doesn't fit enough, you have to scale down by change the the size of the font and you are able to change also the position like this to put it in the middle so you can customize everything in order your text to fit exactly on the composition let's use another one let's use uh, this one this one Here you can change all the text, of course you, can, you are able to change the colors. And here you can put your own text. You can use reduce size of the text. The position you can move like this. Move the position more down. Exactly there. Let's see also how you will you, we can use the the preview builder pack, the extension for Premiere Pro. Here it is on documentation. The preview builder installation here is exactly what you have to do. Just Open the ZXP installer, just drag and drop the ZXP file here to install it for Premiere Pro and After Effects also. After installation, you have to close Premiere Pro and open it again to be sure that the extension installed. Okay, installation installed. So here now from window extensions, Premium Builder Kinetic Tipo Pack, you will find it exactly. Just put it in your Kinetic Tipo Volume 1. Here it is. And just double click, and the, the mobile file will import very automatically to your timeline. The resolution of it, its mobile file is 3840. So it is big in order to use it for any kind of resolution. And also, of course, you can able to change the text after and colors. Remember to fit always the, the text inside the composition.
And here you change the color also. Let's put some color. Okay. You can put some uh, of them that you like. Just click home. For some reason it doesn't work. I will fix it. And this is the way you can zoom out the thumbnails to look nicer. Let's bring another one. Let's bring uh, this one. Just wait a bit. Remember that we are able also to use the Cessa graphics panel, whatever you like better. So here the text is let's change the two text. Wait a bit to load to load it on cache. Okay, it's ready. And here is the animation. Everything is looped on six seconds. Just copy and paste next and it's continue without any problem. Here, this specific composition is a bit complex uh, after uh, effect on after effect. So it needs some time to load it here on the mobile file. So this is the way you use the mobile files and the extension, just drag and drop any kind of composition you like on the on your timeline. It will be updated soon with volume 2 with new nice kinetic people. So keep in touch. Thank you very much. I hope you like it. Don't forget to rate. Bye bye.